Yeah, some special guests that we got in our studio today. Vanessa from Afternoon Express, of course, here celebrating uh, Afternoon Express's fourth birthday, Gracie. Did you know that? Fourth oh, birthday. birthday. Yes. Yeah, we're Happy four years birthday. old. Four years old. Our sister show is turning, and you can catch all the celebrations, of course, this afternoon on Afternoon Express. But for now, Be Well is bringing healthy back. Hey, uh, <laughs> this month we're doing <laughs> cook canola <laughs> oil. <laughs> yeah, that, that's just, wow, boom, inspiration. Uh, but yeah, we're taking you all the way back to basics with homemade nut butters crammed full of omega-3s and 6s already. Be Well Pure Canola Oil is boosted even further with the addition of macadamias and walnuts and peanuts. And so Grace Stevens is here uh, to show us exactly how it's done. This is uh, like... When you think about it, peanut butter, uh, walnuts and all, all kinds of other nuts can be made into a butter. Any nut it's can not, be made yeah, exactly. into nut butter. Mm -hmm. And you, so you can make it to your family's taste, you can make it to your own taste. And you're ensured that your bottle of nut butter has no preservatives in it. And I think that's so yeah. important yeah. for our families. Let's just say, this is so yeah. easy and so good for you. You do not want to miss this. <laughs> you do not want to miss this. <laughs> so what do we got over there? So I'm, I'm, I've got some walnuts here. Then walnuts. I've got some cashews and some almonds and some pecans there. Good. And then some um, peanuts. We some all peanuts. like peanuts. That mm -hmm. also makes your nut butter go a little bit further. But if, oh. if there's an allergy to that, then just leave it out. Okay. Then I've got my Be Well Canola Oil, uh -huh. which is so healthy for you. Tablespoon of this goes in here. This is actually my first time trying any as anything other than peanut butter. Yes. I know the fan favorite in my household, shout out to you, Dad, <laughs> is peanut butter okay. every morning, every evening. It's peanut butter one way. But I think this is such a nice recipe because we take, we're taking the preservatives out, we're keeping it healthy, Absolutely. and we're trying Absolutely. other versions of nuts, which I think is So how, did, how does your dad usually enjoy peanut butter? On a slice of bread. Toasted, non-toasted? Not toasted. He's a simple man. Okay. He just wants it with some butter. Yes. Peanut butter, yeah. of course. You put it together. He has it with his coffee. Good to go all day. Yeah. So, Dad, I'm going to remember this for you. <laughs> Shout out to you, Dad. Yes. I'm going to remember this recipe for you. And hopefully, I'll do you proud and I can try it at home. Okay. Hopefully, oh. I don't, hopefully I don't mess up oh, your recipe. Hopefully you're paying oh, attention no. as well, right? <laughs> uh, by the way, SMS BWELL to 33728. You can also SMS that and we'll send you a link to the recipe as well as a uh, list of the ingredients as well. So, Brilliant. So you want to roast these off mm -hmm. for about, until they get nice and and crisp and roasted. You don't want to burn them, so yes. watch them. So you, what, what, what temperature is your so oven we're at? we're looking then? at about 180 degrees. 180 okay, degrees, yeah, yeah. keep watching yeah. them, kind of toss them around a little bit. Yeah, you, yeah? Yeah, you want to watch them. Yeah. You can also do this on, on the stove top in a pan. Oh, well. yes. Yeah, you know, and then you've got more control over what's happening in there. You know what yeah. used to be yeah. the best, right? So there was this uh, agricultural market close to where I grew up, like in Potch, right? And my granddad every now and then would bring about this massive bag full Ooh. of peanuts. Nuts, man. But like they were still in the shells, oh, so you'd have to yeah. crack them open. Oh, and then my grandma cool. would have like uh, would would um, sprinkle them with salted water yeah. oh, and then put them in the stove, a coal stove. And then you know you had to, had to toss them over hours and hours and hours until yeah, they were beautifully cats, toasted. Th those are the kind of peanuts that you enjoy like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know you have to enjoy them like that. <laughs> Oh, this brings memories of that when you, when you put them in the pan. There. So, oh, yeah. what do you do now, Gracie? So, now you put them in a food processor. Yep. Um, if you've got one of those stick blenders, you can also that put... That could work, You too. know, you can use a stick blender. Good. And you whiz it up. Okay. Beautiful. So, so, this is now the part it's where you... It goes crumbly. Yes. And then it goes to like a ball. Mm. And then suddenly it splits. And then it looks like peanut butter. So, you got to keep it going. Yeah. Oh. And so, are you not adding anything additional so you, to it? Yeah, you're going to add some salt. Okay, go to ahead. Taste. So a little bit of salt to taste. There we go. Today we're adding um, honey. Uh huh. Okay. Oh. Just sweeten it up a little bit. Nice. And that's also to taste whatever yeah. you, your family so likes. So this way, when you spread it on your toast, you can just spread the nut butter because it's already got that sweetness. So you don't need mm. peanut butter and a jam. And jam. Absolutely. Lovely. Everything all together. And here, I put some cocoa powder in here just oh, to give it a little bit. Oh, chocolatey. I love mm. the play with flavors here. Yeah. I'm mm. loving that. It's some vanilla. Lovely yeah, well. stuff. And of course, when you've got the Be Well canola oil in there, that's got those additional omega-3s and omega-6s, so nice and healthy for you and all kinds of other benefits. And you will also notice that it is the only cooking oil in South Africa that carries the Cancer Smart Choice seal uh, due to its high, uh, uh, 
concentration of omega sixes and omega threes. In fact, two to one ratio is what you have. So at wow. the end, once you've done all of that, that's what you have. So right? yeah, you have to really keep it going in here until yeah. you get your butter to be the nice consistency. Patience is required. So just want to mention, you're going to put it in a sterile bottle. Good. Yeah. You have yeah. to sterilize your bottle. You can just Google that. Mm -hmm. and then you can pop it in and it can stay in the cupboard or the fridge yep. obviously the cupboard the consistency is going to be easier to for spreading it will settle this oil yes. will settle because it's natural and it's you know don't freak out it hasn't <laughs> gone off <laughs> I, I see, the screen I see there, um, separating already yeah so it'll mm. separate because it's natural and there's no stabilizers in there and oh, nothing oh my goodness beautiful and then you just mix it up a little up taste again. of it if you will gracie oh just, yeah just a bit just a bit but grace just which is the best way to enjoy this now that we have our oil oh. um, our our nut so butter. it goes in smoothies. It can go in your yogurt bowl. It can go in some Asian dishes. There's oh, lots nice. of things. I tell you what. While we discuss all of that and how it can be enjoyed in various different ways, you SMS be well to three three seven two eight. We're going to take a break and we're going to taste some of this. We'll see you after this. Delicious. This is great. Mm. You should have a, a bit of a taste of that.